What is up guys? Feel free to subscribe if you want to, but guys, we just reached one like today. We got a 2D, I mean not 2D, today we got Resident Evil, a uh, Resident Evil inspired game. If we look at the details, it should say that somewhere uh, that it's inspired by Resident Evil. Here's some of the pictures. It looks a lot like Resident Evil freaking 2. It looks amazing. Holy freaking crap. Let's see what this is, man. Let's see what this is. Yeah, it looks, oh, dang, dude. Oh my god, dude, it has, like, the Resident Evil, like, 64 controls, man. Did it say Blood Fountain? One second, guys, let me put my headphones in so I can hear everything. I imagine that this is going to be the greatest thing I'd ever seen in my in my life. In my life. In my life. Um, okay. Now let me go ahead and turn up the music. I didn't realize the music wasn't up, guys. Um, and just like that, we have sound. It sounds freaking impressive. Holy freaking crap, dude! It sounds eerie. It plays just like Resident Evil 2. There's blood all over the fountain. What happened? I don't know. You tell me. There's, it doesn't seem like there's a way to run yet. It seems like he has a light where Leon's light would be, I guess. Oh, dude, the cameras are awesome. Dude! You could do so much with this. There's an eerie silence outside. You use the same word as me. Same word. Oh my lord, it looks awesome, dude. Holy freaking crap, this is awesome. Goodness gracious. That, oh my god, the shadows. What if a zombie popped out of that, man? You wouldn't even see it. You wouldn't even know it's there. You would be, oh my freak, just look at the freaking top right there where the squares are and the ceiling. Dude, a, a liquor could just jump out of that thing. What? No, don't bleed. Arrgh! Game over. You're dead. Oh, dude. Dude, you could make a legit Resident Evil game. You could legit do it. You could add blood. You could add blood. You can add blood to, uh, to Dreams game. This is the first game that I've seen blood. I guess you can make games that are technically rated M, but the game is going to be rated teen, guys, if you didn't know. I can't see anything yet. I don't know if there's a way to turn on the flashlight. There is. Okay. I did not know where I was. I was like, where, where the heck am I? Um, I am in a corner looking like the Blair Witch. Looking like the Blair Witch. Okay, so now we are over here. Your boy loves Resident Evil, so this instantly gets a five. I I, I don't even need it. I don't even need to see anymore. Like, like you guys might not know this, but there's a lot of channels that uh, re, uh play Resident Evil game mods over and over and over and over and over and over and over. Different types of Resident Evil four mods. Like it's pretty much the same game, but people mod it. So this is big. This is pretty big here. And it, Dreams itself is big. We going back in there where the new music was. Holy freaking crap. Man, I could tell you a legit fan of Resident Evil. I could tell, man. Oh my god. Watching you. I see you. Is there a way to turn that on? Man, dude, the graphics, man. I don't think there's a way to turn that on. Good graphics. That's dope. It would probably be in, in a real Resident Evil game. This is where the keys would be. It would be the keys in there. Then you go back out here and then they'd all instantly be trying to attack you. You have to return back on your light. That's one thing that you know. If there's a way to keep it to where you know it remembers how the, the light's on, then uh, I would do that. That's about it, though. That is a minor complaint. I mean, unless, you, unless that's not what you're going for, you know. 
But you know, with uh, games like this now, like in Resident Evil 5, I think you're supposed to be able to get like some sort of heat stroke or whatever uh, if you were in the heat too long. But they took it out, I guess, because there was a mechanic that was too, um, that was too harsh on the player, or it got in the way of gameplay or something like that. But with games like this, you could actually keep stuff like that. Because in Resident Evil 7, they took something out too. I don't know if it was like a fear monitor, or if it was, uh, they took something out. Oh yeah, they were doing something with like VR, and they made it to where like, something like hold your breath or whatever but they took that out because they're afraid that players would like get sick or something so i know so like you got to be very wary of uh, oh my god oh my god leon no what 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 i will what you gotta be very wary of what you do no the stairs ate leon no no i fell I don't know where I am. What? Why? What? what just happened? Oh no! We broke the game! Leon! Leon! Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, feel free to subscribe for more gameplays and how-tos and art and music how-tos and uh, everything dreams related. Holy crap, that was funny. Holy freaking crap. That's awesome, man. I love the game. I love the game. There's just, you know, a few fixes here and there, and it's perfect.